it is absolutely crazy how well the beetroot business is going for me lately. I mean, beetroots are selling like hotcakes. They are selling so well that I might as well change the saying to hotcakes are sometimes selling as well as beetroot. Well, let's see. Oh, it looks like Ricky CFT has ordered full box of beetroot. Well, my friend, you better ready those 20 diamond blocks because I'm gonna make delivery in a month or so. It looks like the demand for beetroot is exceeding my ability to provide it, so I should better limit how many beetroot can a person buy from my store every day. Just to avoid scalping of beetroot and other uh, shenanigans in a beetroot market. Okay, I believe this sign will do the trick. I am actually finding myself in quite a pickle right now because, as you know, my beetroot farm is at my base. However, lately I've been working in this Zetacraft arena area, so I'm not close to my beetroots, therefore they are not growing. If only there would be a place, a quiet place near arena where I could grow my beetroots in peace. Hmm. Hmm. I imagine this is how it's going to play out. Uh, unsuspecting people are going to be walking around this area like la 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 la, nothing to see here. There are just few pebbles on the ground, but if they only knew that if they press one of them, they can access to this uh, beetroot farm below their feet. However, this looks quite ugly right now. And I should probably uh, do something to make it less ugly. And also I was thinking about uh, how to make a proper way out of this place. Because right now I'm just uh, using this hall right here. And I should probably build something on top. Something that wouldn't give away the disguise of the uh, beetroot farm down below. at this warehouse it's not suspicious at all it's for the arena this is where we keep all sorts of items necessary for all sorts of events happening in the arena so what is on the inside behind this drywall right here we have a bathroom for the employees up these stairs there is a tiny office for the bookkeeping of the warehouse and downstairs we have this really nice looking uh, forklift over here and of course the shelves for the storage. But we also know the secret. We know that there is a secret farm right below our feet. So let's take a look how it looks right now. Well, you can see that I have done some serious building so that there could be some serious beetroot farming down here. And what's even better is that while I was building all of this stuff, I actually managed to harvest enough beetroot to fulfill Ricky CFT's order. So let's grab this box of beetroot and let's get out of this place and make the delivery. 
So, yes, and how we get out of here is simple. We just follow the staircase and we end up in the warehouse through this hidden door. I have no clue what Ricky is going to do with a full box of beetroot. Maybe he's feeding his dragon. But yeah, I'm gonna deliver it to his storage room right now. I hope that Ricky is not going to miss this box and I also hope that he is going to make the payment real soon. But right now it is time for me to end today's episode. And I want to say a huge thank you for joining me. If you liked it, please leave a like, drop a comment and maybe subscribe to my channel. Also, links to my Patreon and other Zetacraft stuff are in my video description. Huge thank you one more time and I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye. Bye 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 bye. Goodbye. This is how my forklift sounds. Ha, 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 ha.